In this video, we will learn how to encode and decode the password with PowerShell. First, I'm going to set a value to our variable pass. And assign a text value, offer underscore password. And then I'm going to encode by using system.text.encoding unicode's function get bytes and it will return as a bytes of this uh, this password over here and then i'm going to save in a variable And I will pass in our variable pass. And now I'm going to convert this byte to a string and save in a variable. base 64 string and then I'm going to pass in our encode pass so we can get a string representation of this and we can print that one encode pass and now I'm going to print it and it's going to Or I will name it as encoded string, and I'm going to run this program or script and see our need to remove this over here, this extra, and then run it again. And now we can see the encoded string over here. I'm just going to clear that consoles and run it again so we can see more clearly. This is our encoded string. Our original text is our password. Now I'm going to write a script to decode this our this string or encoding string and decode back to our our password I will comment this code as so just going to do that and now I'm going to write the code for decoding and I will need this string. This one over here. I'm just going to copy it and save another variable over here. And this is our encoded string. Encoded string and it's a dual encoding string and now I'm going to convert into a string by calling it or convert into the bytes so from our string and that will be our by And I'm going to use a uh, system. Uh, 
forward and from this sixty four string and I will pass in our coded string coded string. Now we have these in bytes and I need to convert into string again to just print out the value. So this one will be decoded value. So I will save in a variable decode value. And now I'm going to call system dot text dot coding and now unicode dot get string and then going to pass in our bytes data and at the end, I'm going to just print our decoded value, and it should be the original form, and uh, that will be our our underscore password. If everything goes well, and you can see after I execute it, it gives us back our original string, our password. So over here we encoded our string and printed and then we took that encoding encoded string and converted back to our original string. So this way you can encode and decode a string or the password using PowerShell to keep on learning. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Awesome Code. Keep supporting me, and thank you for watching.